Hey guys, uh, Christina here again. Oh man, I just got through week three and I'm actually on a high right now because I passed my first um, nursing exam. Yay! Uh, I passed with an 80, which is, you know, it's okay. Could have been better. But, oh, <laughs> that's great. That's Moose. He wants to come in. Um, but 75 is what we have to pass at a minimum to get through each class. So you always want to see a 75 or better. And so I got an 80, which is which was very nice uh, to see. I almost did cartwheels. <laughs> uh, I mean, I studied. I probably could have studied a little better, but I didn't. I didn't have a whole lot of time to study last night uh, or yesterday to. Um, because of my other class and all the stuff I had to do for that class. Uh, but what I did do is I had the, the nursing fundamentals reviews and rationales and I just read through the chapter because the test was mostly on the nursing process so I just read through that chapter and I also have the, um, like you can get the the Van Gogh notes there uh, which is an audio version, it's not the download the audio book and it just gives you the overview of what was in that chapter so I listened to that on the way to school um, and I think it certainly helped uh, I would have loved to have gone back through my book and uh, gone through the notes that I did from the book but I just didn't have time but this these books that certainly helped um, so what else I passed my exam and uh, you know not everybody passed, you know, with, you know, 75 or better. Um, my classmate, I felt really bad for him because he, he missed a 70, you know, a passing score of 75 or better by one point. Is that not the worst feeling in the world when you miss passing a passing score by one point? But he'll get it back. He's, he's a smart guy and his, his wife's a nurse, so he'll get it back. Um, but now that the first exam is out of the way and we know what it's like, I know what to expect. And I know that I'll just need to study better and, and use my time better. Um, what else? Oh, check off. We had our first check off in, in physical assessment. And oh, it was so nerve wracking. Um, it was everyone, maybe not everyone, but most of us were pretty nervous going in, you know, shaking and. It was intimidating because you go into the lab room and she's just sitting there watching you and there's not a, and one of your other classmates um, and you just have to go at the same time and it's like, how are you paying attention to both of us? And you know, the guy I was with, he's he's a funny guy and when he gets nervous, he talks really loud. Um, and then when I get nervous, I kind of go back into a cell because I into myself because I just want to crawl into a ball and hide so I, I my voice gets lower I get really quiet and she told me like I can't hear you you got to speak up because you know he's combined with he's so loud um, <laughs> but she said everybody passed there wasn't anybody who didn't pass the check off um, so <laughs> that's all you want to hear in nursing school you passed uh, what else uh, she, she didn't realize that she had to give us a quiz this week so she's just kind of made it up on the spot and just was like Here's some words. Write down the definition. So I think I got them all too. Um, so I think I did good on that. I did. We got our scores back from a first quiz in Skills Lab, which was last week, and I got a 97 on that. And we took our quiz for that class this another our second quiz this week, and I think I did pretty well on that as well. Um, and then we have our first. Skills lab check off on Monday, which I'm not worried about that. It's like doing the bed bath and, and bed making and stuff like that. So I'm not worried. Um, so that was that was a tough week. That was like the first first of many, I'm sure, tough weeks that I will have. But I got through it, and I think I deserve to relax a little bit today. When I got in my car after I found out I got the a passing score. Um, I <laughs> I put on Lady Gaga and I did the uh, the uh, I passed my first nursing exam test. Pass my test. Um, I won't do it. <laughs> I won't embarrass myself further by doing the I passed my exam dance. Um, but I'm sure you have your own dances that you do. You know, in your car when no one's looking. <laughs> um, so that's that was this week. Uh, it was tough. Um, but you know, you get through it. 
you get through it, you find a way to get through it, and you push yourself to, to, to keep going. Um, so, I'm just gonna, this weekend, I'm just gonna read and do some studying, and practice, uh, get ready for, uh, skills lab check off on Monday. No, that's Tuesday, or quiz on Monday. So I'll study for that. Uh, and I hope everyone is doing okay. I've been watching your videos, and it looks like everyone's doing pretty good. Um, so I think we're I think we're doing okay, guys. <laughs> I think we will make it. Uh, you know what's funny is I wonder. They say in, in my program within the in, you know, after the first semester, like fifty percent of the people drop out. Like whoa. Um, I certainly am going to try my hardest not to be one of those people because this is this is uh, not a choice this is a do or die um, but uh, you know we just have to get through it we just have to stay calm and do what we gotta do and pass and get to that NCLEX and then get to the rest of our lives um, but one thing that was helpful was my um um um, um. <laughs> Uh, my health assessment teacher, she told us this is the hardest that it gets. You know, getting that first nursing degree, that's the hardest that you get, that it gets, because you're learning everything. And it, uh, I don't want to say it, it gets easier, but, uh, it gets better when you go to those higher level degrees, like go back for your bachelor's, um, and go back for your master's. That's probably the highest level I, I want to go. I don't, I don't think I'd go for the doctorate. I'd probably go for the master's. Um, maybe in, uh, certified midwife, certified nurse midwife. Uh, so we'll see. Definitely for the bachelor's, I'm going to go back and maybe do like an online, an online, uh, course, um, to get the bachelor's. Cause that's what you really need is a bachelor's. Uh, so we realized this is an Excel, it's a two year program, but it's accelerated. It's no joke. Um, so I'm glad that, because I, I considered doing a, a one, you know, one year accelerated bachelor program. And, well, aside from being expensive, uh, um, I'm glad that I didn't do it. Because I feel like I don't really have a whole lot of time to do much else right now. But if I had gone to the accelerated program... What would I even do? I would have no time for anything. I wouldn't see Scott at all. <laughs> um, but I think uh, this program is good. I'm, I'm glad I'm in this program. And uh, I'm going to be a nurse someday. So be nice to me, because I might be your nurse someday. <laughs> There's a bag at school that I want to get, and that's what it says. It says, like, you know, WCCCD, Wayne County Community College District. And then it has, like, a syringe with, uh, you know, um... Yeah, syringe. And then it says, be nice to me, I might be your nurse someday. Uh, I want to get that bag, or like a t-shirt, or something that says that. Um, so that's it. I'm I just, I'm smiling ear to ear, because I'm, I'm glad, one, that that week is over, and two, that I passed my first exam, and I passed all the other stuff that I had to do this week. Uh, so now I'm on to week four, and gosh, it's like, I'm halfway done with this first half of the semester, pretty much. And then it's going to be... Uh, finals week and then start clinicals um and I'm sure that'll be a whole another batch of stresses but you know, I'm looking forward to clinicals um all right so that is my time I'm gonna cut it off and I will see you guys on in a week next week so uh have a good weekend and study hard bye